I thought some of you might find this um, interesting. Yeah, so this is the uh, setup I'm running. I'm using a uh, six mil drill uh, to locate and spotting with a longer center and then change that out for um, tapping size for M6 which is going to be M6 bolt holes. This is one of the uh, bearing brackets for the ball screws and this plate I've already uh, drilled and counterboard a couple holes for the bolts which are bolting it to the lathe so I'm just tapping through three three holes, uh, sorry, drilling through tapping size M6, then I'll thread those and that's what's going to hold the, the little bracket on, the little uh, bearing mount. And my nice old, uh, I don't think you'll be able to see that, but more and right clamp. It was a slightly uh, wider centre, but there's a little bit of, well, not much flex, but. So this is what it looks like now. Uh, the two counterboard holes there uh, match up with two existing holes on the lathe. Um, so that's how it bolts onto the lathe. And then these three 
Um, I'm about to tap M6 to mount the the block onto. Yeah, that's why these counterboards so they can uh, sit behind. Um, and obviously, there's we're not using the four holes because uh, it would clash with the counterboard hole. But um, three will be perfectly fine. There's not a lot of uh, uh, not a not a lot of stress on these once once it's going. Um, got the the ball screws. Let's see if I can focus. Yeah, these are the ball screws. Um, this one turned out to be a little bit too long, so I've ordered another one. Um, I'll sell that one, I guess. Someone will get a cheap deal. Obviously, the longest one to replace the main lead screw on the lathe originally. That'd be our well. That's the uh, the part I'm actually trying to mount now with this. Uh, so that'll be for the other end. And then I've got another bit to to make, which will come up here. And then the oops, the motor will mount to that. So. That will go onto the lathe, that will mount there, there's a little coupler which will go in between and then the lead screw, or the ball screw rather, will go down that way uh, to the other end which is just a another bearing block which I'll make another not quite as uh, complicated bracket for that one because it only needs to be just bolted to the lathe and then couple more holes, it doesn't need any extra parts. Yep, so I'll tap those, but uh, it was just a quick quick update. I'd already squared all the uh, squared and deburred all the edges. Yeah, more to come soon.